In the name of Allah, the Beneficent and Merciful, respective viewers, brothers and sisters in Islam, peace and blessings of Allah be upon you all. When coming in contact with a person, one of the first things we notice is the positive and negative characteristics of that individual. The more positive characteristics, the more likely we are to like that specific individual, regardless of their physical beauty. Altruism is considered to be a very positive and likable characteristic. An altruistic individual is disinterested and shows a selfless concern for the well-being of others. The highest degree of generosity and munificence is altruism. An altruistic person, despite having his own acute needs and necessities, makes a sacrifice by giving others preference over himself. Altruism is greatly praised in Islam and is seen to be a quality that has a very high ranking in Islam. Even the act of giving alms occupies a lower rank than altruism. Attaining the pleasure of Allah plays a pitiful role in it. If a person in an effort to save the life of a drowning person gets drowned himself, then the commendation from the Lord for this self-sacrifice is a thousand times more than that for the alms which he pays out. In the Holy Quran, Allah says, and they give others preference over themselves even though they were themselves in need. Regarding this, the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, has said, one who covets something, but suppressing his desire gives others preference over himself, shall have his sins forgiven. Altruism is a humanitarian endeavor praised by all societies. Practically every nation on earth has stories of great kings, brave warriors, noble men and women, who sacrifice their material possessions statuses, or even themselves for some other common good. This is, in particular, greatly demonstrated in the holy religion of Islam. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said in a narration, known to perhaps every devout Muslim, none of your truly believes until he loves for his brother what he loves for himself. The Prophet, peace be upon him, used to prefer the poor to himself. He used to give them his food while he suffered hunger to the degree that he once tied the stone of hunger on his stomach so as to share the pains of hunger with the poor. Imam al-Sadiq narrated, Ali was the most similar to the Prophet. He used to eat bread with oil and serve people with bread and meat. The following verse was revealed for Ali and his family. They feed the distuit, orphans and captives for the love of Allah, saying, we only feed you for the sake of Allah, and we do not want any reward or any thanks from you. With this, we can clearly conclude that the Ahl al-Bayt were the absolute embodiment of altruism. They always put the needs of others before their needs. As their followers, we should always strive to be more active followers of the Ahl al-Bayt Thank you for watching. Join in to the upcoming episodes. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Oh, 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 oh,